Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready for the latest and the greatest from NHL 17 Entertainment? TDI Hockey proudly presents The Skill Zone. What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. It's the inaugural episode of, you heard it, The Skill Zone. It's back after massive outpouring of support last year, last summer, NHL 16. The few episodes that I ran of this series got overwhelming support from you guys and I can't thank you enough. I took the time over this year to make this series better than ever, revamping the rules a little bit and making it more exciting for you guys to watch over the summer. I'm so excited to bring this series back. I want it to be the greatest NHL Road to Glory series of all time. So what that means is I need your guys' feedback to make that possible, all right? So whenever you guys see something that you think you'd like to change in this series, whether it be rules, uh, ideas for challenges, anything like that, leave them in the comments below and I will be sure to take all the good ones into account as long as they make the series as good as possible. But hold on a second TDI. Wait, wait. Some people may not know what the skill zone is. All right, great question, thanks for asking. So, the skill zone is a Road to Glory series like none other. So like any Road to Glory series, I'm gonna be working from Division 10 to Division 1 and try and ultimately win the Division 1 title. But one of the other main goals throughout the series is to mix in real life hockey challenges to build my skills. So over the course of the series, I not only want to progress throughout the divisions in Hut Online Seasons, I also want to see my real hockey skills progress as well. So basically how it's going to work is I'm going to complete real life hockey challenges and I will be rewarded based on how I perform in those. Those rewards will go towards building my team, making it better, helping me progress throughout online seasons. And from there, I'll continue to do different types of hockey challenges to upgrade my team in various ways. So throughout this first episode, I'm gonna be explaining the rules, so pay attention and watch along. Um, in the meantime, we're gonna start up with building our team. So first thing we have to do is jump into Hockey Ultimate Team and create a new team. So we're gonna go with the Skill Zone. Obviously, it's gonna be our team name with the abbreviation of SKZ. Let's open our starter pack and see what we're gonna be working with. All right, here we go. The first pack, the inaugural team to kick off this series, and we go with Brian Boyle, who's on Tampa Bay in this game, but he's actually a Leaf, like in my starter pack. So we're gonna blow through this and see who we get. Oh, they actually threw in some S2 cards here. Okay, so we start off with Vertanen, William Nylander, I like it. Uh, MacArthur, an ex-Leaf. Boschaman, an ex-Leaf. Hyman, a current Leaf. McCulloch, Marchenko, a current Leaf. I don't know what the NHL's doing, but... Oh, Konechny, that's a good card. He could be a game changer with that 90 speed off the bat. That is good. Um, overall, you know, pretty average team, like all these teams are. So here's how the challenges are gonna work. I'm gonna complete one challenge before every game. So the rewards from each challenge are split into six tiers. One being the highest, six being the lowest. Counterintuitive, I know, but you'll get it. The tier six prize is nothing. I will walk away from that challenge performing terribly and as a result, getting absolutely nothing. Tiers five to three will all reward me with a pack. So tier five is a gold plus pack. Tier four is a series two expansion plus pack. Tier three is any of the special packs that are out on the store. Tiers one and two are specific player rewards. So tier two will be an 87 plus overall player and tier one will be a 90 plus overall player. Now one twist that I added this year is that the prizes are cumulative for each challenge. So that means that if I get tier six, I'll get, just get the tier six prize. If I get tier five, I'll get the tier five and the tier six prize, which is nothing. If I get tier one, 
I will get tier one and all the tier rewards below it. So I'll get everything. I'll get three packs and two players. That is massive for this series. There's also one more rule that I added this year that will determine whether I can upgrade a specific player based on how they performed in the previous game. But I'll save that rule for when the time comes, so keep an eye out. But in the meantime, we're gonna jump into this first challenge. What is up guys? We are out here for the first challenge of the skill zone. This is technically the inaugural season of the skill zone because last one was just a trial. So this is the very first one, all right? We're gonna do some shooting challenges today, all right? So this one is going to be the four corner challenge. Forget this one. This one's on play. So we're gonna do the four corner challenge as usual, like they do in the all-star game. I'm not an all-star, so don't expect me to do as well as they do. But like the all-star game, what's gonna happen is I'm gonna shoot at all four corners and I have to hit all four in the least amount of time. So since this is a timed challenge, I'm gonna put the tiers in terms of time intervals. So they're intervals of five seconds. So you'll see them on the screen now. That's what I have to shoot for. Let's try and get all five prizes to start off the skill zone. Let's go. Remember, timer starts once the first puck is released from my stick. Three, two, one, go. All right, so that was not my best effort. I loosely finished the challenge, which is a positive thing, but I struggled on every target. I needed at least a couple shots, which is disappointing. But the point of this series is that I got to play to Division One, win the title, of course, but I also want to see my skills develop over the course of the series, boys, all right? So we made a little bit of a mess here. We broke that target. I don't think I did any of the top three tiers. Took a bit of a while to get going. So let's go inside, see how I did. All right guys, so we're back here in the game. Not the best result from that challenge. I'm hoping that once I do that challenge over again, and you'll see why I would soon, hopefully I do better and improve. Um, so basically I got enough for a tier four reward. I got just under 25 seconds. So that'll give me a series two expansion plus and a gold plus pack. So we'll start off with the gold plus pack here. Let's open it now. Oh, what does EA have in store? The first pack of the series, boys. What are we gonna get? Okay, Ryan Ellis, 85 overall, our best player. Um, so I'll take that any day. We get another rare player as well. Who's gonna come up? Ryan Miller. Not the best pack by any means, but 285s. There's our starting goalie and a starting defenseman, and we wanted an offensive one, so I'll take it. Next pack here after that challenge, series two expansion plus so we got all series two players here and some gold consumables so what are we gonna get let's open it very quick and see if we get anything Nate Prosser so I guess it's an upgrade to our current Nate Prosser Nick Schultz defensive defenseman Davidson another defenseman Garrison okay and Savard a lot of defensemen in this pack our uh, our goaltenders will thank us and one left winger so Let's put this team together and see what we're going to come up with before our first game. All right, so looking at the team that we're going to start off our first game with, it's looking pretty decent. We got William Nylander on the left wing because his faceoffs are terrible. So I'd like to pair him with Konechny, whose faceoffs are decent, and Mahalik. That is a scary first line for Division 10. Uh, Vertanen, Hyman, and Lindbergh. De La Rose, Boyle, and Smith Pelly, Como, Shore, and Bork. So not so many pickups. Actually, De La Rose is the only addition from those two packs here. But our defense is a completely new look thanks to those packs. We got Ryan Ellis and Jason Garrison on the first line. Savard and Jalmerson from our starter pack on the second. And that upgraded Prosser with Yemlin on the third. And then our goaltending also got an upgrade with Ryan Miller. So starting off in Division 10, the first game of the series, we need six points to advance to Div 9. That's three wins, four wins for the title. I think we can get that. I'm pretty confident in myself. Um, so let's do it. So we have got our first victim of the skill zone. It's Domo Elite. 
His best player is Kyle Turris. He's got the all-star jerseys on. This is Div 10. So we are looking for a challenge here. We're looking for a good game. Let's go. Ellis stands him up at the blue. Come on, block that shot, boys. Miller with the first save. a boy. Konechny going through the middle. Saucer right across. Oh, it's on the goal line. Almost had a beauty to begin this series. Tip, re re rebound, and Konechny's there to pounce on it. one nothing for the skill zone. The first goal of NHL 17 skill zone was a greasy one, but we'll take him. Oh, nice play. Good save, Miller. All right, back. We're working it down low, boys. Across, there it is. Boyle, back door across the slot, and he's wide open. And that's 2 nothing now. Oh, no, not there. Lindbergh fights for it, though. Oh, my God. Vertanen gets absolutely rocked, but we keep it in the zone, and a massive save by Jim's Reimer. I said Jim's Reimer? Oh, on the four check. Heavy on the forecheck, Della Rose, the big body. And then he's wide open, Delonte smith Pelly, 3-0 with 6.4 to go. This is looking like a rout. And our stats say it all. 11 shots to 4. He's got less than a minute on attack. His passing is brutal. Let's keep it up. Let's go. Across again. Boom. Something's got to go. There it is. McCulloch, 4 nothing from Nylander. When is it going to end for this guy? Right now, that's a rage quit. We got as many goals as he had shots. And uh, yeah, that was a blowout game, but we expect it. You know, we're Div, we're Div 10. So let's see how the boys played in their first game. Boyle with a goal and assist. Della Rose, two assists. McCulloch, goal and assist. So they led the way. Um, and our goaltenders, Miller, strong with a shutout, a four save shutout, but that's still a good start. All right, guys. First game is done. It's out of the way. Let's forget about it now. Let's move on. Let's try to improve the team even more. In this next one, we're continuing with the shooting theme here. We're going to be shooting again. This time, we're going to be trying to hit the crossbar. I've got the GoPro set up over here so I can see all my crossbar shots down the line. So we want to try and smack this bad boy as many times as we can in 10 attempts. All right, so I've got the tiers again. You guys can see that. We obviously want to go perfect in this one, but we'll see what we can do. Here we go. Three, two, one. Skills on, boys. Ah, inside. All right, we didn't get it. Ah, inside again. Oh, two. Inside crossbar. Doesn't count. Uh, oh, for four. Oh, my God. There's one. One for six. Inside again. One for seven. Inside. One for eight. One for nine. Uh, that's lost this one. One for ten. One for ten. Okay, so that was painful. Um, I did terribly. One out of ten, in fact. I kept hitting the inside crossbar. I got one out of ten. That is good for a tier five reward, which is just one gold plus pack. So here it is. Let's open up. I'm surprised we even get rewarded for that. That is truly, truly one of my worst performances I will ever have in this series, I promise you. Obviously, there's lots of room for improvement, but we get a coach. Okay, Mark Abbott. There you go. We get some more jerseys. Jack Johnson. Okay, another rare player. Another one more. Schwartz. Okay, an 86. Our first 86 of the series. All right, so after that reward pack, Schwartz has cracked our top line, and we got rid of Bork. And then on defense, we slotted Jack Johnson in on the second line, and we dropped Emelin. We're good to go. Our first 86 in the lineup. It's looking good. We're starting to up the ante a little bit with our team. Let's see how they do in the second game. So we're still in Division 10. Two points from one win. We're undefeated in that first game. We need three more wins. Let's get it here and get straight to the Div 10 title. All right, the new look skill zone boys are ready for their second game. Let's try and uh, make it short and sweet here. 
And start with an offside. Oh my god, he somehow still got it. He somehow still got it. He somehow still got it. Okay, we're good. Ellis. Walk in. Tip it. Oh, Konechny almost had his first. Oh. Oh. Oh, almost had it. Oh. No, over. Rebound. Oh, right at the side of the net. Couldn't get it. Slap it. Boom. Oh my god. Elliot is a monster. Get on him, oh, big turnover, and you can't do that, son. You can't go right up the middle. Boyle picks that off, and we're up and running. Here it is, De La Rose. Oh, De La Rose going end to end almost. Here we go. Sauce up the boards. Como. Sauce it wide. Bring it back in. Snipe it. Oh, my God. Elliot flashes the leather again. Oh, yeah. Boyle. Boyle. Oh, boy, almost had his second. All right, Konechny, we want to see the speed. Oh, Schwartzy. Oh, that's beautiful. Right off the faceoff. Not even 30 seconds in. Schwartzy gets his first goal in his debut game. Oh, there he is. Oh, we were gone. Yes, Vertanen. Spinorama. Oh, my God. What he should be doing in the NHL, Jake Vertanen. Uh, oh, look at this work by Savard. What a play. Savard draws like four on him behind the net. That's a goal every day of the week. Don't let him by. Nice. I like this aggressive play at the blue line. No, deked in the wrong way. McCulloch just snipes it though. A turnover again in the high slot. And we're making him pay big time for these turnovers. It's four nothing. Oh, it's in! Oh my god, another big save! And that's uh, a penalty shot. Ref. 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 R Ref? Ellis now. Oh my god, finally beats Elliot at the glove side. No screen, no deflection. Straight in. What a shot by Ellis, and it's five now. Oh, there it is. Finish that. Yes, Hyman. All right, the boys are rolling, six nothing. Let's finish this one off. Another one, Boyle, seven. What was that, like eight seconds apart. We're tearing it up in this second game. There it is, that's the final whistle and we route that guy to a seven nothing shutout. And two wins from two games gives us four points. We're halfway to the Div 10 title. So let's see who took us to that victory. Mahalik with three points, Boyle with two goals, Ellis with two points, Hyman, it was a it was about a half team contribution there. That's two shutouts in a row now. And that's one a full 60 minutes, 12 saves on 12 shots. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the first episode of the Skill Zone. It's back and better than ever. Drop a like on the video if you've enjoyed it. Subscribe for more, and I'll see you boys in the next episode.